Hey guys, what's going on? It's the hood. In this video, I will be going over 10 of the best dynamo combos that you guys need to try right now in chapter 2, season 3. If you guys are new, make sure you subscribe, leave a like, turn on post notifications. It would be really helpful for me and it would mean a lot to me. Starting out guys with the first combo, we have the dynamo skin alongside the red sheet and the medax from chapter 2, season 1. Overall, it's a really try-hard combo, the red shield matches the red on the dynamo skin and it's obviously a really try-hard cosmetic so I felt like it was a good choice for this combo and the meta axis matches both the red sheen and the dynamo skin and overall just further complements the combo. Moving on guys with the second combo we have the dynamo skin alongside the grey variant of dragon's crest from season 10 and the dive knives from this season's battle boss. Overall dragon's crest is the perfect backlink for the dynamo skin it has the same color scheme and looks really try hard and clean with it and the dive knives kind of match the theme of the combo and make it way more try hard in my opinion. For this combo if for some reason you don't have the backlink you can replace it with the eternal shield. Moving on guys with the third combo we have the dynamo skin alongside the Fabian K from season 6 and the arctic gamma variant of the specialist pickaxe from chapter 2 season 2. Overall I feel like Fabian Cave and Frozen Shroud are the two best capes you can use with the dynamo skin. I personally like the Fabian Cave more but if you don't you can obviously use Frozen Shroud instead and for the pickaxe I feel like the specialist axe is a good choice as it's really basic and I'm sure most of you have it. Moving on guys with the 4th combo we have the dynamo skin alongside the dead boots katana from chapter 2 season 2 and the steel shadow axe which is free you just have to complete some challenges to unlock it. Overall it's a really simple and clean looking combo the grey color scheme in general looks really good and the combo is extremely easy to use so if you guys haven't already make sure to try this combo out. Moving on guys for the 5th combo we have the dynamo skin alongside the Dana backlink which comes with the Suki skin and the driver axe. Easily one of the most try hard combo you can use with the dynamo skin at least in my opinion both the backlink and the pickaxe are really sweaty and try hard and overall give a really clean looking combo. For this combo if you don't have the Dana backlink you can replace it with wolf pack which came with the dire skin. Moving on guys with the 6th combo we have the dynamo skin alongside the trophy sack from season 10 and the reckoning axe from season 6. Easily one of my favorite and one of the sweatiest combos from this list the trophy sack matches the theme of the dynamo skin and it's easily one of the best backlink you can use with it and the reckoning axe is a basic but good addition in my opinion it adds a lot of detail into the combo. For this combo you can also use backup plan as the backlink and you can use bootstrap as the pickaxe as well. Moving on guys with the 7th combo we have the dynamo skin alongside the spike satchel backlink from season 10 and the crowbar axe which is free you just had to complete some challenges to unlock it. Overall the black and grey color scheme of spike satchel looks really good with the dynamo skin and crowbar is a basic but easily a really good choice with this combo as it looks amazing with the skin. If you wish to change the cosmetics with this combo you can use the floppy backlink instead of spike satchel and you can use the sea scorpion axe instead of the crowbar axe. Moving on guys with the 8th combo we have the dynamo skin alongside the white banner cape and the icebreaker axe. Overall it's a really expensive but clean looking combo you can obviously use the banner shield instead of the banner cape and if you don't have icebreaker a cheaper option would be the white variant of the bank shots axe which came with the 8 ball skin in chapter 2 season 1. Moving on guys with the 9th combo we have the dynamo skin alongside the game plan backlink from season 10 and the green variant of the mech axe from season 9. 
I personally like the greenish color scheme for this combo. I know game plan isn't really the perfect backbling, so if you don't like it, you can use the combo without a backbling. Or if you really want to use a backbling for this combo, you can use Rainbow Clover instead of game plan. Moving on guys for the final combo we have the dynamo skin alongside the saltwater satchel backbling which comes with the fish stick skin and the merriment axe which is available last year during Halloween. This combo is really try hard it looks amazing but it's a bit harder and more expensive to make in comparison to the others. For this combo if you don't have the merriment axe you can use the candy axe instead and if you don't have saltwater satchel you can replace it with something basic like darkest edge or wolf pack. Those are all the combos for the video guys, please know that all of them were based on my opinion. If you enjoyed them, make sure to leave a like, subscribe for more rankings and combos. Also if you wish to support me, my creator code is TheHood. Thanks a lot for watching and I'll see you all in a bit.